I'm Kay Eckert, uh, representing the Doherty companies along with the Vanguard uh, line of products. Um, basically, uh, new displays and things that we wanted to highlight are the VM series uh, line of population and non-population monitors. Um, part of the new system uh, that we wanted to highlight were the flow meters. Um, basically, it gives guys an electronic uh, electronic version of uh, liquid metering options uh, that can really dial in um, exact gallonage totals, um, things that you wouldn't be able to see in other competitive systems. Um, two different lines here displayed, the 4600 and the 4400. Um, population versions uh, with flow capabilities uh, on both monitors. Uh, this one uh, is non-population only. Um, but basic designs and inputs kind of uh, running from the flow meters that can be mounted per row or mounted manifold style. Um, different flow rates. Uh, this one, these are set up to monitor two different flow rates, uh, all programmable throughout the monitor and those features. Um, individually per row uh, can also be graphed uh, to where you can see what each what each row is doing uh, through a histogram. <clears throat> Flow on both sides um, and you can monitor it individually per row. Right now we're running a population simulator uh, as well as actual liquid flow um, divided up on on both monitors and the thing that you really want to highlight to growers is um, through through different configurations for what they're running on their planner or their 28 bar uh, just how minute a physical change on uh, something as simple as a valve or hose routing uh, possible kinking issues or fold issues and normal flexation that you get through normal operation um, just how much of a deviation that it can cause um, something as much as you know a, a 10 percent change can mean a a, a big problem in the end result and seeing that crop come up. Um, but being able to monitor, monitor that uh, down to tenths and hundreds of a gallon um, can be pretty important in the long run.